America, the documentary news show that takes you inside America. I'm Samantha Savage. With cities across the country facing continued fiscal difficulties, legions of Americans are facing the harsh realities of budget cuts that are forcing them into unemployment. Drake Tanner brings you this story from Chicago. We all have friends and family who've been affected by the economic downturn. More and more cities have been forced to make the tough decisions to rein in spending. Meet Alyssa and Elissa, two dedicated young women caught in a web of deceit and discrimination related to the city's Metro Transit Agency, who just happen to be twins. So, Alyssa and Elisa. Walk us down this sordid path of intolerance and injustice. Two people with equal qualifications, stellar performance reviews, and perfect attendance on the job at the MTA. What went wrong? Well, we've always enjoyed finding jobs where we could work together. So you do everything together? Duh! Duh. We have a very special bond. And indeed they do. Because Alyssa and Elissa are Siamese twins. So you two have never been apart. So, tell us about that fateful day. You went into work. We loved our jobs. It was the glue that held us together. Talk around the water cooler was that we were both up for promotions. Co-assistant supervisor. We're totally awesome at our jobs. And, and everyone, everyone knows it. it. We just came back from lunch when Mr. Smith called us into his office. Alyssa, Alyssa, please report to Mr. Smith's office in HR. Promotion! <laughs> Elisa, congratulations on your new promotion. Welcome to middle management. Elisa, you're fired. Clean out your desk. Come with us, ma'am. No, 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 no. She goes. She stays. And that's when things went terribly wrong. So, why did you terminate them? Budget cuts. Budget cuts? So, really, how much money are we talking about? Look, I had to let one of them go. Besides, you're overlooking the fact that I did promote the other one. And somehow you don't see this as discrimination. What was I supposed to do? Split them up myself? You know, you want to know about discrimination? Let me tell you about discrimination. I was one of Transier's top pilots until 9-11. But some of the twins' co-workers shared a different story. Oh, you mean those two clingy blonde broads, the ones that got fired. <laughs> yeah, I remember them. I don't know if it was discrimination or not, but I'm pretty sure one of them got fired because she was a woman. Just saying. We spoke to another high-ranking city employee who agreed to talk to us on condition of anonymity. Of course it was discrimination. He couldn't even keep their names straight. In fact, he once told me, Alyssa, Elissa, who can tell them apart? And honestly, what's the point? Plus, one time, he sexually harassed me. This is all off the record, right? Alyssa and Elissa's discrimination suit is still pending. In the meantime, these two courageous sisters have founded a support group for other city employees who've also found themselves on the wrong side of a pink slip. Workers like streets and sanitation employees John and Jan Skabamowicz, whose story we'll explore in a future edition of Inside America.